significant.
to this party we having and such and such and such and such. And she's like, nah. I mean, man, man was like, nah, I ain't going. Because I got to do, you know, run back and forth. You know, I got my girl and my situation and all that. And she's like, well, later. You know, link up with us later. You know, if that don't jump off the way you want, you know, hit us up. So, Mad Man was told that, because that's what he told us. Like, yo, man, I got this thing set up. Like, if this party ain't jumping, we going there. So, this is what I don't get. Bear wasn't even at that party that everybody was going to. And he was supposed to be there. There wasn't no problem if Bear was there. He just gonna clown Bear or whatever. Even though Bear make all that money. And Man Man don't really make... Man Man don't make shit. Tony don't pay Man Man nothing. That's true. Man Man is broke. Man Man get all his money from his job. Yep. And that ain't nothing. So Man Man be front. All the time you hear him talking, he be front. Everything he get, he get from his girl or from his job. That's it. Yeah, that's her car. Man got six times more than Man Man. But he always but talked down to bed. Man, man, talk. You know, he's a talker. So that's that's what he's good for. Talking, talking, talking. And running off at the mouth. Talking about his life. And, you know, like, he better than bad. So, bad's messing with these SDs. So they out doing their thing. So when they came back around, they, that bear wasn't around and none of this stuff. And they were shocked. Everybody was like, man, I'm surprised Bear ain't here. You know, Bear normally come around and do this and that. Bear wasn't there. So the party was lame. And Everybody got, you know, dressed up for nothing. The party was, you know, lame. Nobody really cared about the party no more. Then you get a phone call. And, he, you know, he's talking to this uh, rat. You know, this little bird that he met on the ground. So, naturally... He goes ahead and sets it all up. Talk to the rat. Little bird. That he met on the dog on Snapchat. So. He was like, where's the address? So she gave the Eddie. He goes over there. For the meet up. And he told, he's like, drop me off. Give me a water. I'm good. Then he said, nah, you know what? I'm going to just drive. Because in the morning, I got to get a new headlight. So I'm going to go over to Sam's. He said, all right. Got in his car. Man, man, driving himself now. Because I was going to drop him off. But man, man said, nah, I got my car. I'm good. Man, man gets in the car. Goes over there. To the spot to go meet up. With old girl. He gets there. He kicking it over there for a minute. Next thing you know, it's like some dudes laying on the floor. It's home, girl. They got the music playing. He's like, the lights in there was like red. You know, and you know, she's 
she was laying up in the bed, and she get up, and he was like, it looked like a, like a crack house, where she was staying at, so he's like, the houses look funky, you know what I'm saying, so, he was just like, man, I don't really feel good, because I came in here unprepared, you know, he got, you know, something in the car. So after that, you know, he said, man, he was talking. He got a drink. He talking to old girl. Then he passed out. Then when you wake up, his, his pants is off. His shirt is off. Everything's off. He's butt naked. And it's a dude running next to him. He half dressed in his underwear. It's another dude next to him in his underwear. And the chick he with, she over there. And she's got her breasts out and everything. But she got you know, a man part. So he jumped up like what? And the world just went down. So man man grabbed his pants, put on everything, and you know they all in the living room. They go in the living room and he don't say nothing. He just confused. He go to the bathroom, he throw some water on his face, and he just feel weird. He don't know what's going on. So, and the chick was like, you know, this happens all the time. You know, that's just the weirdness. You'll get over it. That's the only words, you know, the tranny said to him. He just zip his coat up and just walk out the door. And he go to the car. He ain't feeling too good. Like he about to throw up. He go in his car, then he come back, and he step on the porch, they hear, you know, because it creak, it's got the, the wood porch, you know, so when he step, they hear the creak, he come back to the porch, they thought he forgot something, so they stood up. Like, they was going to check to see was the door locked, you know. And the other person is sitting there, they watching TV on the couch. And he just stood there, and he just sprayed through the door. Five down. People are in the back. So, that's what happened with Mad Mad. Now, everybody was like, when was it bad? Because when they came to find out in the court, situation play out the way it did, you know, man, man, he wouldn't have been going through what he's going through right now, and bad didn't do what he did. So, the whole hood, that's 
that's why Ben moved out. Because the whole hoods, they basically think Ben's responsible. They just like, Ben, Ben responsible for this. This is all on him. So now, you know what I'm saying, it's going up. And that's why everybody was warned out there. If it wasn't for the COVID-19 and then all of these, you know, everything else that happened after that, Black Lives Matter, they still, it still would be cracking the way it was. That's why Ben ain't been back. Ben can't come back. You know, you already know. It's burnt up over there, you know. Do the sim. Because it ain't, it ain't nice. Even though they trying to say, oh, Bear want that and this and that. That's because they getting money with Bear. And, and when you throwing paper around, you know, people going to be like, yo, they going to make any excuse for you in the world. Be like, oh, no, he want that, man. He was at his mama's house. Oh, he was doing this, man. Y'all tripping. Because they want that money to come back. You know, when you feed people, over time, they're going to pop his head back in the hood. And everybody's saying, yo, when he, it's going to be like, pop go to Weez. He's going to come back in the hood, get late, and it's going to happen. Guys ain't gone. So, that's what happened. Well, there you have it. Don't forget, you can always support the page by hitting up the Cash App. Carcino is the name. Don't forget, the Carcino for Life Patreon, you know, is on RIP. And if you... These type of hood stories can possibly only go down on the Patreon. So we're going to actually give you this one here so that you can hear the type of situations that's going to be going on over there in the Patreon as we go through some massive, massive stories. So if you click the link also, you can go to Streamlab in case you guys want to Streamlab it up. I feel you on that. I'm with you. J Biz and the gang, appreciate all the love and support. And don't forget, man, hit that like button. I'm out.